Well, this is first time headlining the Civic in Auckland, and this is one of those venues that you dream about performing in and headlining in. Never ever thinking that I would be able to perform and fill this place myself in a million years. And this is such a surreal night. We've been in and out of lockdown, and this show has been rescheduled three times. So third time lucky, guys. And then, oh my God, <laughs> yesterday, like day before yesterday, they shut down the CBD, which is where we are. And we waited with bated breath yesterday. We were all tuned in at two o'clock to RNZ. And then we got the news that we could. And huge sigh of relief. I'm just completely filled with gratitude that, you know, there's nowhere else on earth right now that can do this. Thanks, J.A. We appreciate it. <laughs>
<laughs> but here we are. We are here together at last. <laughs> A beep, beep, beating inside my chest Until I get you loving, I won't get no rest No matter what you say or do Or what kind of hell you're gonna put me through I'm gonna walk, walk, walk Back to your arms Yeah, you're gonna talk all your charm Papa done told me you're no good Mama said don't love you cause she knew I would I'm gonna walk back to your That you get me in A silver tongue Never gonna leave me alone But every time I try to stop myself I just can't go I'm gonna walk Walk, walk Back to your arms Yeah, you're gonna talk Talk, talk With all your charm Walking in this dress, honestly, it's a little bit of a, little bit of a hazard, but it could get quite entertaining for you guys. <laughs> I'm sorry. <sighs> honestly, you can dress me up, you can give me an orchestra and a chandelier. I'm still, I'm still me. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> well, we're going to do a song that, th this is a really, really special song to me. This is a song that my dad wrote. And um, before, I, before I sing it, I have to say that tonight is extra special because I have my two little boys, Charlie and Sam, sitting up there. <laughs> and I just wanted to say hello before you fall asleep. Because <laughs> um, when I played the town hall a couple of years ago, Charlie came, he was six back then. Now he's a big eight-year-old, so he's got this. But Sam was quite upset because he didn't come. He was four. This is way past his bedtime. He's loaded on sugar. And uh, he's going to crash very shortly, I can tell. So <laughs> I thought I'd just say hello, and I love you. 
I love having you here. <laughs> things about that's come out of of this time is that you guys have all of your New Zealand artists at home you know normally we're all over the world <laughs> and for us it means we have all of our colleagues and our our community um, home as well we have each other home and supporting each other and lifting each other up and encouraging each other through this time and, you know, it's very rare that, you know, you try to arrange having special guests on your show. And, you know, uh, without fail, one of you is overseas and you're like ships in the night. Um, but I want to bring out, I'm very lucky to have some lovely friends and special guests on the show tonight. And I want to bring out the first one. This, this uh, artist is one of my best musical buddies. We write together, we produce together. And uh, he's one of my favorite people to sing with. Please welcome Mr. Delaney Davidson. Yeah. <laughs> 
<laughs> We're gonna do a little song that we wrote together for the new Chickaboom album. And when I say new, it came out in February, exactly one million years ago. And counting, right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Lower me down into the ground The 16 miles of chain To find the heart for the man I love One that wouldn't stray Through the door to the devil's door From the ashes dark and stained He pulled out a new black heart With 16 16 miles of chain Since I have you up here, we may as well do another one. <laughs> okay. <laughs> this, uh, this next song is one of the very first songs that we wrote together. And uh, it's off the Dynamite album. And we don't, uh, I don't know that we've ever gotten to play it live because uh, we could never quite do it justice without, you know, an orchestra. Yeah. A big boss orchestra which I kind of feel sums up my life. I feel like I need one all the time now. <laughs> you know, whenever I enter a room, <laughs> make toast, anything, but... Um, Instead of the solo trombone you're used to. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> wah, wah, wah. <laughs> sorry, I'm sorry. <laughs> or the foghorn. Oh, come on, Tom. What's Come on, man. Ah. Oh. <laughs> He's on the shakers. Sorry, I'm sorry. All right, let's be serious now, people. I'm going to do a serious song. We're going to do the song Justice for you tonight here. 
in Auckland at the Civic right now. song is one that that I wrote um, about my paternal grandmother and um, when I first wrote this when I first started to write this song I wanted to write a song kind of talking about all the women who made me who I am my my two grandmothers and my mother and and when I started writing the story of my paternal grandmother uh, she kind of took over the whole song and uh, I had uh, all, all three women um, had very traumatic experiences uh, with childbirth. And um, I had this idea going around in my head, a line, um, this whole world turns on a woman's pain. And I didn't want so much to talk about, to dwell on the pain that she went through as much as I wanted to 
celebrate the incredible resilience that every woman I know has within them. We are a strong bunch. <laughs> was a child of the nation Raised on a white man's little reservation Three girls, one more in the belly of her mama Robbed by death, giving life to her daughter Baby grew up fast, yes she was a fast one one half child, the other half woman Shotgun waiting for the baby who arrived Man run off, left a child to raise a child Partake of pleasure and reap the shame Garden of Eden. The moment her lips touched forbidden fruit, he said, I'll curse you with pain and a man will rule. year I had I, w I was incredibly honored to be asked to be a part of the Waiata Anthems project yes it was very very special and I was hugely honored and it was quite fitting I had to I had to learn some Tadeo and I was scared and nervous and had nothing but patience and support um, from the wonderful producers that were creating this wonderful project. And um, uh, it, it's quite fitting because I actually became officially a New Zealand citizen last year as well. <laughs> and, uh, but I thought, just for Auckland, you guys get a little treat. Christchurch and Wellington didn't get this. Sorry, guys. Sorry, don't tell them. Um, we've got a special treat. Um, I have a wonderful, wonderful artist, a brother from another mother, Mr. Troy Kingy is gonna join me. <laughs> Big 
tea. I dressed up for you. I got the, I got the good red bands. Yeah, yeah. I said, I wonder um, how many red bands have been worn on the stage of the Civic. And if they have, they definitely haven't been as flash as those ones. Oh, thank <laughs> So I want to sing this song tonight in half English, half Taneo, to celebrate being half Canadian and half New Zealander. So, uh, yeah. <laughs> So gracious, so polite Each time you pass me on the street And then I cry myself to sleep <laughs> You just wait. You just wait. There's more, but wait, there's more! Uh, this, this next guest of mine, actually, first I want to tell a little story about, about this song. Um, you know, when, when we were in lockdown, um, I have my two little guys, who I'm not sure are still there. <laughs> they might be sleeping by now. Um, I was home with them. My husband uh, is an essential worker. And so I was, I was kind of flying solo quite a bit throughout the week. And so when, uh, when my hubby would get home on the weekends, um, I would go out, he'd let, you know, I, I'd go out and, and, and have my little, my little break, escape. And um, I'd go for a little run, a walk. And uh, as I was running and, and eating ice cream, um, <laughs> Hey, we all have our own fitness <laughs> regimes. That was my COVID fitness regime. And it worked. It worked for me. <laughs> Whatever gets you through. And ice cream definitely gets me through. Um, but while I would go out for these uh, fitness sessions, 
I had the words to this song going through my head and uh, on, on one, of, one of the days I was out. And it's a song that I was asked to perform with, um, with the wonderful Don McGlashan, who isn't here tonight, I'm sorry. I just want to preface it so you're not like, what? Oh. Um, and, and it was for the Offering Project. And it's, it's a hymn that's about 300 years old. And when we were asked to sing it, I had no idea how timely it would be. It's amazing how a 300-year-old song, you know, humans throughout history, we're all the same. You know, no matter what we're going through, uh, we, we need to search for that peace. And this song I found to be a, a great comfort found a lot of solace and comfort in this song. And um, to sing it with me tonight, I'm going to invite uh, one of my, my, my dear buddies. And, uh, you know, she and I used to do gigs together. I kind of feel like I owe her one because uh, the last gig we did together was quite a few years ago. And it was the two of us uh, singing to 12 people at Roasted Addiction Cafe <laughs> in Kingsland. Good times, guys. It's no longer there, but, um, but we are. We're still here. And there's a couple more than 12 tonight, so I kind of felt like, you know, this could make up for the fact that I invited her to do a 12 people in attendance gig. So would you please welcome the beautiful Miss Nadia Reed.
Too shabby, eh? <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> well, we're gonna do a, a song together that's um, off of off of Chickaboom, and it's a song that I, I normally sing. I wrote and, and sing with my brother Jay, who is obviously stuck in Canada. He was gonna be on this tour, but. Hello, 2020. Um, but hey, I mean, come on. Come on. I know. I know. And now he's like, okay, you've raised the bar, and I can never compete with that. So uh, sorry, Jay. Sorry. You've been replaced. <laughs> You're much prettier than him as well, I have to say. Um, but uh, this, this is a song that, you know, normally those sibling harmonies are pretty tricky. And uh, Nadia's like, what are you doing to me, Nielsen? You're killing me here, making me learn this. But as you'll see, she does an amazing job. And thank you so much, Nadia, for being here with me tonight and doing this whole tour with me. All right, let's sing. Let's I'm ready sing. for like 10 more shows now. Yeah, let's do 10 more. <laughs> You guys are ready, right? We only have a small, a small team up here that easily travels. <laughs> oh, wow. I try to speak tongue-tied and weak Each time I try to start Any fool with eyes could see any fool with ears could hear My love for you is oh so clear To any fool with a heart I try to flirt lipstick and skirts But I don't know the art Any fool with eyes could see Any fool with ears could hear my love for you is oh so clear To any fool with a heart You can't see the forest for the trees Hear the rhythm pounding in my veins Pom pom Like a drum The oldest love song plays I just can't take this hurt Trees, hear the rhythm pounding in my veins. 
like a drum The oldest love song play She touched your sleeve You turned to leave I wave while you depart Any fool with eyes could see Any fool with ears could hear Your love for her is oh so clear To any fool with a heart Promoted to stagehand, Delaney Davidson. <laughs> Damn, I'm gonna have to pay him more now. Jeez. <laughs> well, this has been a year, and uh, and the thing is, it will continue to have its ups and downs. And uh, the one of my favorite things about this year is having to do interviews where people start by saying. So how does it feel to have your whole career destroyed by COVID? <laughs> it's been awesome answering that question over and over. Um, so I was starting to kind of really dread interviews and, but then I, I, I had a, a question in an, an interview recently that asked, you know, what, what song has really been, you know, kind of the soundtrack for you throughout this time. And I had to choose this next song. Uh, this song is one that, that my dad wrote as well. And he wrote this, it was the very last song that he ever wrote in the hospital. And he was, he was staring death in the face. He was in one of the most scary and fearful moments that a human being can have. And he still managed to find hope and resilience and write this song, which has been a huge comfort to me through this time and an encouragement. And I hope throughout the months and years to come while we, we travel through this challenging time together, um, that it will be a comfort to you as well. Don't be afraid For I I'm with you And I'm gonna see you See you through another day And do not don't you dare be discouraged. I'm gonna help you, help you on your way. Troubles go, but don't you know? 
know I told you so I'll be there protecting you Through the burning Sure as hell 
You guys feeling better? You got some ice cream in you? <laughs> Everyone's like, I don't know why, but I'm feeling this craving for ice cream all of a sudden at a Tammy Nielsen show. Well, something really great happened this year, amazingly. Something good came out of this year. Um, this next song was nominated for um, Best Country Song at the, uh, yes, thank you, thank you. I'll take that, I'll take that. But not only was it nominated, are you ready, are you ready? It won Best Country Song 2020. <laughs> I'm trying to get as much as I can because literally our uh, Radio New Zealand announced it on the radio and that was it, there was, there was no applause. Thank you. Thank you for that spontaneous <laughs> applause. So nice of you. Man, I really, I mean, I really didn't get any applause. how rich all musicians are. I love how that's like immediate laughter every time. Um, I, there seems to be a little bit of a misconception about how much money musicians make. Um, my mother-in-law was telling me that uh, one of, one of uh, our family relatives was saying, you know, oh, I see Tammy in the New Zealand Herald and in Women's Weekly. She must have made her first million by now. Yes. That's, yes, oh, how we laughed. Oh, how we laughed. And, and, and then I actually cried quite a bit, which was quite surprising. But um, I thought I'd write a little song to kind of clear up any misconceptions about what it's like to grow up in a family band and continue to be a musician even when you still have your own choice. <laughs> Daddy born poor, mama was too, walking through the 
the snow plastic bags on their shoes. Papa's selling houses, sleeping in the car full of babies in the backseat underneath the stars. Well, hey, hey, just work a little harder. Hey, hey, punching that clock with a work and prayer and a little bit of luck. Make so much money, need a 10 ton truck. Well, ha, ha, He lost his job, put a hitch on the back of mama's little silver dodge Drove with enough and bought our clothes and guitars Right down to Nashville, gonna be big stars Hey, hey, just work a little harder Hey, hey, punching that clock with a work and prayer and a little bit of love Make so much money, need a ten-ton truck Well, <laughs> You try to make a living, pay dues, get moved right back to the beginning When the pie gets bigger, everybody wants a slice I've been working since back in 89 Well, hey, hey, just work a little harder Hey, hey, punching that clock with a work and prayer and a little bit of luck Make so much money, need a 10-ton truck Well, <laughs> record my boys sing this song with me and I did ask them if they would like to sing it tonight and they are already asleep so <laughs> I'm enlisting some uh, people who are a little bit older and more dependable <laughs> and quite frankly cheaper <laughs> than my kids um, I would like to dedicate this song to every single parent who did home learning during lockdown. Oh, yeah. We survived, peeps. We survived. We lived to tell the tale. Um, I wrote this song over school holidays, and uh, as you can see, I didn't even have time to pick up a guitar. These are my children's blocks. Legitimately, yeah, they, they only uh, charge a small fee for me to hire them for each show. Um, but I would like to especially dedicate this song to, uh, to all of the mamas out there, all of the queenies. Queenie, queenie, don't drop the ball. Queenie, queenie, don't drop the ball. Queenie, queenie, don't drop the ball. Down come baby, cradle and all. Queenie, queenie, don't drop the ball. Queenie, queenie, don't drop the ball. Queenie, queenie, don't drop the ball. Now come baby, cradle and all. Jiggers need feeding, dog needs a bone. Bills need paying and the bank's on the phone. Dishes need washing, kids do too. Man come home and he want to woo -hoo. Queenie, queenie, don't drop the ball. Queenie, queenie, don't drop the ball. Queenie, queenie, don't drop the ball. Now come baby, cradle and all.
Screaming from the kettle, knocking at the door. Baby, kick the bucket full of suds on the floor. Rain starts falling, clothes on the line. What's a stay at home mama do with all that time? Queenie, queenie, don't drop the ball. Queenie, queenie, don't drop the ball. Queenie, queenie, don't drop the ball. Down come baby, cradling all. Working through the day, working through the night. Planes and trains and another misfly. Mama gotta hustle, do another show, cause they won't play a lady -o on country radio. Queenie, queenie, don't drop the ball. Queenie, queenie, don't drop the ball. Queenie, queenie, don't drop the ball. Down come baby, sing it with us now. Queenie, queenie, don't drop the ball. Queenie, queenie, don't drop the ball. Queenie, queenie, don't drop the ball. Down come baby, cradling all. First time I was ever I ever attended a show here at the Civic. It was many, many, many years ago, probably well, over a decade ago, and it was Mavis Staples. Mm -hmm. It was Mavis Staples, Aaron Neville, and the Blind Boys of Alabama. I mean, what? What a lineup! Um, so that was my my first show here. And then last year, I got to open on this same stage for Mavis Staples. Yeah. Was anyone at that show? Yes. And that night, um, I, I, for the very first time, sang this next song for Mavis. How embarrassing is that? I mean, like, bearing my heart like a valentine, like, I love you, I'm such a fangirl. And, you know, when I wrote this song uh, and, and put it on the album, at first I kind of, I was a little bit hesitant because I thought, you know, is it too fangirl, uh, you know, just sing about like how much I love Mavis. And, and then I thought about it and I thought, no, you know what? There are not enough songs out there about women lifting up other women and celebrating other women who inspire them and who they love and admire. So I think it's important. I think it's important to do that. So we're gonna, oh, can I get a little, little shaky shaky? Thank you. We're gonna do this. I'm gonna take my life into my hands because on the very first show in Christchurch, I don't know if you guys can see it, you can't see it. I got a really big bruise on my hand. I'm playing, I know, everyone. Thank you, thank you. Can you tell I haven't been around people very much? I'm like really milking the interactions here. <laughs> oh, thank you, thank you. <sighs> thank you, say it again, say it again. Thank you. <laughs> I'm so sad. Anyway, here we go, rock and roll, guys. It's worth the bruises, here we go. Saints get fancy sitting up in the choir. No matter where you are, 
Well, it is, uh, it's time. Time to, uh, to get Mr. Davidson out here once again. Come on out here, Delaney. Artist, singer, slash stagehand extraordinaire. <laughs> I am going to have to pay extra, aren't I? Just call me Jimbo. <laughs> so this song is one that we wrote together, and we were having so much fun writing it. We were, like, cramming in all these crazy rhymes and, and words, and, uh, and we kind of failed on the songwriting 101 front when we realized when we went to sing it that we hadn't really left anywhere to breathe. Um, it's not necessarily a bad thing, though. It makes it more entertaining for you guys. And uh, we're going to hit it. Take it away, boys. One, two, one. Tell me that you love me. Tell me that you love me. Tell me that you love me and you never let me go. Tell me that you love me and you never let me go. Tell me that you kiss me. Tell me that you kiss me and you do it real slow. Tell me that you kiss me and you do it real slow. favorite songs on the new album and it is uh, it's one that Delaney wrote and I quietly stole <laughs> in between my uh, stint as a stagehand <laughs> he leaves me little songs you know wrapped up in sequins like little mouse traps and I go for them <laughs> sounds, sounds great <laughs> Till the dream 
sleep away the heartache. Deep, baby, deep. Fall into the endless night. Before you girls go, hey, 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 
Can I have a big hand for my girls, Vanessa Abernethy and Yuli Lynch. I have known these girls since I first moved to New Zealand. And we used to do four hour sets from 10 p.m. till 2 a.m. at Sky City, bitches. <laughs> that is work. That is work. This is fun. That is work. <laughs> Thank you, girls. I love you both. <laughs> All right. This is a man's world. This is a man's world. But it don't mean nothing without a woman over a girl. To take us over the road And man made a train To carry the heavy load Man made the electric lights To take us out of the dark Man put a ball on the water Just like Noah made the ark This is a man me some Mr. James Brown, but uh, he may have left a few things out. I'm sure it was just an oversight, but I thought I'd make a few little amendments. Woman wrote the code that took a man to the moon. It was a woman made a little thing called computer software too. It was a woman Discovered stem cell isolation And right here in New Zealand We got a prime minister Just had a baby While she's riding a horse
so much. Whew. I don't understand all those walks. <laughs> Doesn't make sense. Oh my gosh, like this, this is like Christmas up here. Shedding tinsel. This must be what it's like to have a pet unicorn. Thank you guys so much for coming out tonight. I know it's been a, a, a scary week and I greatly appreciate you guys coming out. Um, it's really special to be able to celebrate together with you, getting to be in the same room and share music in the same room together. There's nothing like it, nothing replaces it. <laughs> And uh, before we do this last song, I'd like to acknowledge uh, a few people tonight at the end of our tour. Back here we've got the man who did all the arrangements, except for Stay Out of My Business by Claire Cowan. I think she's here tonight, so I best say that. Um, <laughs> Claire's like, yes! <laughs> but tonight he did all of these arrangements so beautifully for this wonderful, wonderful orchestra. I feel so privileged and honored to have all of you here tonight. And please give it up for Mark Dennison, our musical director. And a big hand to Snapper, Michael Knapp on the lights and all the production all around the country. To my management team, Pippa, Ryan Kidd, who's been holding us all together, and to Miss Simone Williams, who is the one who had this whole idea in the first place. I said to her, you know, I, I, you know let's do a tour together. And she said, oh yeah, 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 let's do it with an orchestra. And I quietly soiled myself. But sometimes it takes another person to be brave for you and kind of push you out of the nest and out of your comfort zone. So a big, big hand for Simone Williams, who this show wouldn't have happened without her. We're going to finish off with, with this song. Thank you guys again for being so kind to us tonight. Take my heart It used to be so Supple and sweet And now It's withered On the vine As before And then there's after You were mine Take my faith So strong and full of fire Broken down and blind There's before And then there's after You mine You mine Sun comes up, the sun goes down World keeps rolling around and around
my hands They used to hold you so tight Now they reach but they never touch you in the night no. Here's before ha, 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 ha. And then there's after
67 Chevy, baby, built to last. Bring it on a paycheck, singing on your tape deck. Mama makes the babies in the dinner and the cash. Rules, I make them and I break them. Fools, my mama did raise them. I'm a big boss mama. Big boss mama. Big boss mama. Big boss mama. Take the band and rock it with the money in my pocket. And I'm blowing up the stage like a silent beat rocket. Get down, run for cover. Just hot, soul singer, Max Slinger calling all the shots. The band's in line.